Croatia. Uh, I'm Ivan and I'm also from Croatia. And we're both from uh, Zagreb, the Polytechnic of Zagreb. And we were asked to answer some questions about our Erasmus experience here in Portugal. So, why did you choose Ezad to do the Erasmus studies? Um, I chose it because it seemed like it has a really good program. It had nice courses and I like that it's a completely art school. So I was just from the, I was looking for some school that really has an art program. <laughs> And this one seemed optimal. Like Portugal is not too expensive, or it's the prices are the same as in Croatia, and it all seemed very nicely organized, and the website was nice, and everything was, you know, perfect. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I was looking at the options, and the options were this. I think something in Czech Republic and in uh, Greece. And I didn't want to go to Czech Republic because Czech Republic and in Greece there was like uh, the lots of things going on in Athens and stuff. So mm -hmm. I chose this and uh, that's when I realized I did a, a good option because uh, the school is really nice and the country is warm and cheap and the people are cool. So I wasn't thinking about it too much but it it, it was all okay in the end. Yeah, and we don't regret it, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay. How do you classify your integration in the school, city, country? How do you? What does it mean? I integrated pretty well, I think. Um, everybody in school, everybody was really nice, they were polite and very understanding that we're foreigners, that we don't speak the language, that we don't know anything. Uh, the professors were also uh, full of understanding and um, I don't know. I was only worried uh, that I w wouldn't like the dorm, the dormitories, but um, it was actually perfect. They're really nice here, they're new and very uh, nicely kept. I think my integration is pretty okay. Uh, like in any school, the people are nice. There is no bullies or something, so it's, <laughs> that's normal. The school is very nice, yes. Yeah. And in the city, I have a, I had good luck to live with a Portuguese guy who's also studying here, so I'm pretty well integrated <laughs> in the city, and I have a few Portuguese friends, locals, so that's. Oh that's yeah, cool. the Erasmus buddies. They helped a lot. I think. <laughs> <laughs> what Erasmus buddies? What Erasmus buddies? For, for the first few weeks. Yeah, for the first few weeks, yeah, yeah. of course. Well, but that wasn't the most important part when you, you know. I, I, I got the most help from Azor, and I, th I don't think he's Erasmus buddy. No. And Kato also. The, the no. Really nice guys. But you went to all the par parties, right? In the beginning? Yeah, there were, there were, yeah, there were a few parties. And yeah. in the country, pff, I don't know. Good integration. I look Portuguese, so I'm okay. <laughs> Whenever I go, nobody asks me nothing. So, yeah. Did you learn anything? Portuguese, I mean? Mm. No. No. Me neither. Uh, what do you think are the major cultural differences between Portugal and your country? So, Portugal and Croatia. Um, I don't know. <laughs> the weather is nicer here, but yeah, that's not a cultural difference. thing. It's, uh, mostly. Everything, like in deeper down, it's the same. Uh, it's almost like Portugal is Croatia ten years ago without war, something like that. Every everything is more chilled and relaxed, and there is not so many constraints on everything. And everything is more. Uh, you don't have to worry with so much about deadlines and stuff. I like that. And if you're late few few minutes for something, it's not it's not a big deal. And I think Croatia is more strict, and I think that's, yeah. that's the main I thing. think people are nicer here. Yeah. I think they're more open. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah defi definitely. That's, that's a big I difference. Yeah, people are definitely more open. Yeah. What did you find the most interesting or cool, and what did you find the most weird or curious in the school or city or country? Well, for me, it was really weird. Um, the time that 
times that people go out here. It's really late. I, I was not I was not prepared for that because in Croatia you go out at, at what nine something yeah, like nine, that ten. nine ten yeah. that's normal and here party starts at one a.m. and that's yeah. like of course of course it does why wouldn't it and it goes on till the morning so. um, the interesting thing the interesting thing or a cool thing is that I really like the school much more than I thought I would. I knew that it has really good courses, but um, <laughs> it was, it was, it was, I like how um, experimental people are, are here, open to new ideas. You can do whatever, it's art, right? Um, so I like that. Cool. I think it was cool for you that you can curse and nobody understands what you're saying. Curse and creation. Oh yeah, but the people, <laughs> some people tell me that everything I say in creation sounds like a curse word because <laughs> I have, whenever I use it I'm like mad or something and people like only hearing me use it when it's like uh, rough sounding, but yeah, it, I can curse anywhere and that's, that's, that's cool, but after a while it gets boring. So, uh, so anything weird? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know, I think people will surprise me here. They do some things that you don't expect them to do, like just nice things, do something for you or do you a favor. But at the same time, they're pretty lazy, so it all evens out because they don't do something that you ask them to do or something. But it's nice to be surprised by people and... Uh, yeah. It's like, it's interesting because you can get into I don't know, really cool situations, just sitting on a coffee, like some friends pass by and they're like doing something later and it's just like, yeah, you want to come with us? Yeah, sure. And it leads to cool situations. And I think weird is, I don't know, your bakery. <laughs> I like your <laughs> yeah. bakery. And food, fast food. Fast food is very bad here. I don't like that. But everything else is... Yeah, and the system. <laughs> When you get the meat or bread or something, and you have to take the ticket, I don't, I don't understand it. Why? Oh. <laughs> Why can't there be just a line, you know? And <laughs> Why take the ticket? Yeah, it's that's, different. That's a weird thing. That's a weird thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What's the next question? Our recommendation to future incoming students. Oh yeah. Well, I uh, recommend that. I don't know. A lot of. Um, well, actually, a lot of students uh, found their own apartments. I recommend uh, students to stay at the dorm. I don't know why they wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> he disagrees. I don't know. Uh, I like it. Why would they? Why would they? No, give me one good reason. Uh, they have heating there. <laughs> so we have one radiator. No, it's okay. You had to buy it. Visit Lisbon and Porto. Yeah, yeah, of course. Porto is real. I don't know, I recommend students <laughs> to get their own apartment because when I was looking for it, I found like the cheapest one and it's uh, like realistically it's terrible. It's like cold, pipes go bad, the oven shocks you when you go like to cook and uh, it teaches you to, you, have, you just have to adapt, you can't fix nothing, you just have to adapt, so you have to like live around it and I think that's really cool. Much, much better for me than if everything was working perfectly and uh, it has like a, a home feeling to it and the dormitory I was living in there and it was just like a room and th this is a home and I think it's <laughs> it can't even be like get an apartment that's like number one priority when you get here and uh, travel because around here is really beautiful for yeah. and surf Try surfing. Yeah, Nazare Obidus, it's like a must. And um, meet local people and do things that you normally wouldn't do in your country because this, this place is really open to everything and you can do anything. Zvonim se Ivan, tu sam došao na Erasmus i kogod se ne znam, vomi oko dolaska ili ne, pa ga preporučujem da dođe jer fenomenalno. I ovaj, da, mislim, nemam, nemam šta više drugo za reći, Do, no, 
fakat Erasmus treba iskusiti jednom u životu i pička materina i kurac. Bog, ja sam Magdalena i tu sam na razminu u Portugalu i super mi je i da mogu opet bi došla, preporučam svima da to probaju. Možda čak da odu na drugoj godini ili tako nešto pa da ako im se svidi produže. I ne znam, Portugal je super. Da, pokaj da. I škola je odlična isto, baš ova E sad škola. E sad. E sad. E sad, da, da.